think I'll see anything I can because I'm really excited. Does that mean yes? There's an echo. Can you hear me? Hey, Britt. Oh, I'm going to take this mic out then. Hold on. My YouTube isn't even open. It, what about now? Oh, shoot. Okay, wait a minute. I don't know what to do. The audio isn't. Hey, Brian. All right, let me see something. It says built-in microphone. It's an echo, echo. All right, hold on. Oh, man. Still an echo? It's bad. Let me make sure I don't have any. There's white noise. Oh, that white noise is my computer. All right. Well, we we got the video, so that's the best part. I really feel like that's the fan in my computer. I don't know what to do about that. Ariel said hers is behind. The echo is gone. Are we going we to work, we gonna, we gotta work this out? Oh, hey, y'all. This is exciting. Well, I guess I should start. Better without the AirPods. Okay. All right, y'all, we just gonna have to deal with this for now. Okay. Hi, everybody. I'm so excited. I think the white noise is my computer. I don't understand why it's hot. What do y'all do about that? <laughs> All right, so anyway, okay, so this is just my little lunch bunch. I'm so glad y'all are here. I'm really excited to the point where I had irritable bowels. Anyway, um, I wanted to show you guys um, what I got from Saks. So, you know, Saks or Fifth has these like really good sales. And I have never paid like 88 for like these Tom Ford quads. And they have some recently. So I've collected four of them. And um, I just want to show you. I want to say hi to everybody. Ashley, Yadi, Mom, Britt. Talk to other people too. Janelle, I also want to call you Happy Mix. Victoria, Willard, the movie and makeup moment. Oh, Tiffany, Ruby. Thank you guys. Brian, my nephew, my sister's on here too. All right. Anywho, all right, so let me show you what I got and then I'm going to just do my eyes. So the first thing I got was this. Um, this is the Illuminating Powder Duo. This is so weird. All right, look, y'all. So it's a highlighter and a bronzer. This is a little bit um, dark for me, but if I use it like just a little bit, it's kind of cool toned, but the highlighter is really nice. And this was, I want to say it was 39. It's a little bit cool toned for me, but we can make it work for 39. Okay. And then, all right. So I have um, the three quads that I got in a lipstick. The first one I got, this is one of Yachty's favorites. This is the Double Indemnity, and this was $44. Yachty, I'm sure you remember when I got this. Y'all see it? Look how pretty this is. Uh, I have not used this one yet. And then 
I'm glad the video quality is good. I'm going to work on this um, audio. I also got Daydream, and this is the purple one. And I got this on the recommendation of Morgan Turner, who I'm sure most of you watch. And this is her favorite one. And this one is still on sale on the website for $44. So these are like half off right now, which is amazing, actually. And then, but the one I just got, this one was $39. And this is the one I want to use today. So this is called um, Photosynthesex. And I really like this one because this shade right here is a duochrome shade, but I haven't tried it out yet. But this one was 39 and then there was another one. There was, um, wait a minute, let me get it. Frostfire. I think Frostfire is on there. It's right here. Oh, this one right here. Sorry. So this is so cool, y'all. Okay. So this is Frostfire. I got this one too a while back when it was on Saks. But I think this is on there and Super Nouveau for like 39 y'all. Like, if you don't mind not having, um, you know, if you don't mind not having something that's like, it just came out, like, because I don't care. And then the last thing that I got is this. Look at this. This is called um, Lip Spark. I'm not sure what it is. I don't know what about it is. But look. So it's like one of those glittery lips. Hey, Janet Beer is here. Okay, so I'm going to swatch this quad and I'm really excited. Let me find it. All right, so let's take a look. I'm so happy, y'all. Yeah, Morgan Turner, like she is the blame for so much. Like. She ranked, she ranked all of her quads and she liked this one and another one called Pretty Baby, but I don't think I found that one on sale, but I would have gotten that one. That one has like a nice dual chrome shade too. So here's the first one. So it's just like a, you know, your basic gold. And then this is there. I hope y'all are still here because I don't know what happened. Man. Maybe y'all are still here. I'm going to just pretend y'all are still here. All right. So look, am I still buffering? I'm going to have to get this internet situation together. Are y'all here? Wait a minute. Can y'all? Mm -hmm. right, I'm back in business. If it cuts off again, y'all, just this internet. I don't know what to say. Okay. So we just going to go ahead. Did y'all see the swatches? <laughs> and do the eyes. I guess this is why this is a test. This is why. See, Britt, I got to get this together soon. All right. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use my um, my Bristles Beauty brush and this gold shade. And I'm going to do the. Um... OK, good. My sister's doing that time. And I'm going to do a brow bone highlight. This is so cool, y'all. It might need my computer graphics. So what do I need to do? Do I have to buy something else or up? Hey, Dr. Ash. Hey, D. Yeah, let me know what I need to do. I do have a Mac. Can I see that? Oh, yeah. Let me just do the other side. See, this is what I be doing. And my students will be like, Miss Chambers, did you do your makeup? I'm like, yeah, I did. So yeah, I, I'll work on um, upgrading whatever it is that I need to, the graphics. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Hey. All right. Now I'm going to use this, uh, let's see. This is so funny doing this. Uh, live but i'm gonna use um this bk beauty from my brit clark set my basic bridge brush set try to say that <laughs> this is the 207 brush and i'm gonna use the brown i'm just doing like a little just a little simple look but i love quads because they're just so they're just so easy 
Aww. Is it Jamie? Jamie, is that how you say it? J-A-M-I? Thank you. All right. So, y'all. Hey, Demi. Demi K. K. Demi. That's my girl right there. She just started her channel, too. Waiting for her next video. So, I'm just putting this in the crease. I'm really just trying to um, get to the blue shade because that's the one I really want to try. I'm, I feel like it's Christmas right now, y'all. I really do. The 101. Which? Wait a minute. Oh, yeah. This right here, <laughs> this 101 brush is so good, y'all. It's coming back in tomorrow, Ashley said. It is so good. That's like... Mm. and just so y'all know this vibrant um blush is vibrant poppy i didn't realize i put so much on but thank you Brett. i'm so nervous it'll get easier um yeah, the Wayne Goss um, blush. And I have one that I ordered another one of those Huda Beauty stick foundations uh, just because I really like this so much. And it um it sold out. Oh, yes, girl, the palette book. Yeah, I was like, I need this on display somewhere because I had it up here in the front and I was like, nobody can see it. And I love it. Oh, my nephew's back on here. Have you looked on my car? So I know I have been getting my um, Mickey Mouse ears. I just got the it's a small world one because this is um, supposed to be our theme for the school year. This is what we were going to decorate my classroom as. And unfortunately, you know what happened with COVID. So I told my team, like, get these ears, y'all, because they collect ears, too. But they didn't get them. And I saw they had one pair left. And I was like, I'm going to get them maybe twenty dollars. So. Hey, Chicago Low Luxury Makeup. Thank you. This is the only time I can probably do a live unless I really, really schedule it. Um, because otherwise, Marky and August would be all up in it. All The video I have tomorrow, August is all up in it, sweeping. He told me he was a janitor. This is a lot. Hey, Auntie Merle. And I've also been working on cleaning my palettes off when I um, show them on camera because I know they look dirty. You know what? Yes. Okay. So I just heard about this cosmetics company store, y'all. And there's one that's like literally like 15 minutes in my uh, in my area. It's like 15 minutes. And they have all kinds of stuff. I've never... I don't know when they um, started coming around, but I need to go there, but I just don't go anywhere. But but I think you can do an order and then I think you can just like pick it up to breakfast live. That's all. That's all good. I feel like it's always time to talk about makeup. Not Brian, I'm not the goat. Who's on uh, who, Brit on here is the goat of lives for real because you can't even tell the difference. Britt, I watched one of your videos the other day, and I was like, it was weird that it wasn't live. I was like, it's not live. All right, y'all. I'm just doing that. All right, let's get to the good part. So I'm going to use this um, duochrome shade, and we'll see what it looks like. It's really pretty, though. Let's see. You said we give her a hard time. Hey, Eileen. Oh, my pal yes yes they do look used i want people to know like it, it ain't no uh what do you call it a dog and pony show up in here i dig into my palettes y'all see the swatches you know what class they have yeah i'll find out so this is like i would say that this could be more of like a topper but you can use it by itself. But I think it would have looked really nice. Like if I put the blue one first and then put the other one on there. Oh, Brian's supposed to be in school. I thought he was. Ew. I thought Brian was on lunch break. It's got a little bit of fallout, but I mean, who cares? 
Okay, so did y'all, <laughs> did any of y'all watch the videos um, of the, because the melt videos are starting up for the Beetlejuice? What do y'all think? Yes, yes, use and abuse these palettes because, I mean, we, we got to do something. Yeah, my palettes look, some of them. Mm. I like it. Do this side. But you know, these lunch breaks are not going to last forever. I don't know when we're going back to school. There's another county that's close by and they, um, they said they're not going back until April 15th at least. But my county was trying to go back November 16th and then they came at the last minute and was like, oh no, we're not doing that. And I was like, that would have been a mistake. Oh yeah. I, I honestly have been on the fence about it, about Mel. I don't know why. Honestly, I know y'all are going to be like, what? The one, I'm on the fence about the green and purple palette. I don't know if I want the green and purple together. Like, it reminds me of the Joker. I could do like all green or like that neon green yellowish look. And then the all purple. I guess you can mix them. I don't know. But the gray and red one, I think that one is so pretty. So pretty. And I think that I want the green lipstick and I want the, there's like a iridescent one that looks nice. So, so I like this. Like I said, I probably, if I just did this with a brush, it wouldn't have gotten all over my face, but I think that's how you find out. Do a lot of most. I do want to do a lot of most and makeup. Mommy, if you have to, if you see this situation here, it's a lot and I had to get a bootleg ring light situation because I forgot that I needed a ring light behind this camera so I have I wish I could show it to y'all never mind that mirror's dirty never mind. um hey Morgan Morgan I was just showing them what you made me buy <laughs> Hey, Hot Bella Experience. Yes, Morgan, this, I'm trying to think of what else. I have a whole video plan. You know what? I'll have to save it because I have a whole video planned of stuff. And like Morgan is one of my favorites, y'all. And y'all know she's a teacher too. And we actually probably may live an hour apart, maybe. But um, do you have a two-hour lunch break too, Morgan? Because... I love these two hour lunch breaks. Usually my lunch break is like 20 minutes. I'm going to take this blue shade and put it underneath them. You see. But um, I try to catch Morgan's videos and I know I don't catch them all. But then like when I was really looking at stuff in my collection. I feel like a lot of it is inspired by her. So I appreciate you coming. That really makes me excited because I'm nervous. So... I love this though. I feel like, you know, for somebody like for Christmas, this is like a, you know, like a nice little luxury gift. Not little, you know. You can't get rid of me. Brian, you better go back to school. Between Morgan and Kara with these Tom, these Tom Ford quads. There's another one on there too. It's the Frost Fire, it's the Daydream, and I think it's Super um, Super Nouveau, which is kind of like a neutrals one. This is pretty though. Hey, it's Crystal. Y'all, y'all want to see some luxury stuff. Y'all get on it's Crystal because she has got it all. Hey, Jen. Oh, thank you. This is so exciting. This really made my day. Ooh, why is getting in trouble? I don't know if y'all can hear my sister. Y'all want to have to go back to school. <laughs> but really, my nephew, Brian, is like, he he is my biggest hype man. So, like, he's here one week on one week off. And, like, every time I talk to him or see him, he's like, how many subscribers do you have? And he's like, well, once you get to a million, are you going to quit your job? And I'm like, I am so glad that you have these ambitious plans for me. Because um, that is very nice. Very, very nice. That's okay. Hey, K Bella. 
Oh, I, and Kay Bella's a teacher too, y'all. But she's actually like at work, work. So you probably only have like a 30 minute lunch break. I know I, my, my lunch break really comes down to being like 15 minutes. Once you drop the kids off at the um, cafeteria and then go to the bathroom, I usually have to make some copies and then I got to go pick them back up. So he wants to see it. I know mommy, but if he's not going to be in school Thursday, then he needs to go back to school. I wonder why the internet cut off like that though. I'm going to have to figure that out. I have really been dealing with this internet issue and I, I kind of feel like, is it because the whole county, like everybody's in school and they weren't prepared or what? I don't know what it is. All right. So now I'm going to do a eyeliner. Um, um, I have these. I love these y'all by NYX, these jumbo eye um, pencils. Hey, real quick. Okay. Can y'all talk me out of the Kylie and Grinch collection, please? Tell me it's not green enough or tell me. Tell me something. Somebody. Be like, don't get it. It's Kylie. I have, believe it or not, I have nothing by Kylie Cosmetics. Nothing. But I think it's so, I, it's the Grinch. It's the Grinch. Oh, yeah. Start your channel. You'll have a whole support group. You'll have all of us. That's what we do. I'm going to use this one. This is called French Fries. It's just a, just a metallic brown. Thank you, Morgan. That's not helping me. You know what? So this is what I was thinking. I was thinking maybe do a like build my own palette for the palette. But I thought that she has these little um, eye sticks that are coming out with the collection. And I thought I can do that. I know I can. I know I can. I don't know. Ruby. <laughs> like, uh, uh, anytime I do something with Cam or Kylie. Kim, I mean, not Kylie. It's like, uh. but um, I know I can dupe that Grinch palette. I could make a better Grinch palette. I, here's the thing. They, people are complaining that it's not green enough or Grinchy enough. But then if it was something that you could only wear in Christmas, you'd be like, well, you, it's not, it's not worth buying because you can only wear it, you know, once a year. And I kind of feel like, you know what I'm saying? Nope. I know all enablers in this chat. We have a running joke. Um, crystal about how we're all going to be living out of our packaging and how we can depot the Pat McGrath um, shades because that's going to be the strongest packaging that we, we've got. Maybe the Anastasia Beverly Hills Pro palettes only because I tried to depot that and it was a, um, a huge failure. It was terrible. We duped it on the phone. What do we do? No, I know we don't need the wrench palette. I know. I'm thinking about the uh, those sh those shadow sticks. Like there's a nice green one. I'm gonna tell you, Dr. Ash will keep you in line. She'll be like, no, you don't need it. Don't get that. I don't want to support. Them. I know. They don't do anything. They don't. They don't. I don't know what to say. All right, that's it. What do y'all think? Just a little simple. So people are even grinchy about the Grinch palette. <laughs> yes, they are. All right. So I, th I think I'm going to stick with Mel. This is my, um, just my Thrive Cosmetics Mascara. I guess I'm going to just stick with um, Melt. No, but um, I sent, Ruby and I were talking about it, and I sent a picture to Yachty. This indie brand Alien Cosmetics, they have a holiday palette coming out and it looks like not exactly all, so don't get excited. Hey Kelly, but it looks like Muerte. Without kind of without the teal shades, but it's so it's giving me Muerte vibes, and I'm gonna get that. I really want that. I want to try that brand out because I saw um, a video the other day with someone trying it out and it, the quality looked good. I do, Tiffany. I have um, the smoke sessions. You know what? Thank you. See, that's all. That's all I needed to hear. Excuse me. All I needed to hear was that. And I talked myself out of the Wayne Guys palette too, y'all. Let me show you. Oh, where is it? I don't know what I did with it. But I have the. There's a mini Pat McGrath palette. I don't know where I sat it because I had it sitting out. But it is her. Um, 
her dark, it's called Dark Star. And it's got the gray, the blue, the black, and the beige. So I was like, I can't get Wayne Goss. I just can't do it. Kylie is not. I haven't tried any of the Melt Stacks. I would love to, though. Because I heard the Stacks are way better. But I did like, um, yes, I I know where Tay's gone, Mom. I, I sent them a message. And they were like, unfortunately, we will not be bringing Wert back. Murate back. Really, too bad. Too bad. So sad. I created this brand. Yeah. Oh, I did see the um, Tim Timtalia review. Didn't get a good review for the Wayne palette. That sucks. I really like him. We really don't need everything. We don't. We really don't. That's what I'm going to be talking about in the video tomorrow. So tomorrow, I'm a navy blue would have been nice. I'm going to be duping the Raw Beauty Christy and ColourPop. Because I was like, you know, sometimes we see things in the color story that we see them. And we don't realize that, like, we have those colors. It's hard for your mind to manipulate them. You know what I'm saying? Into a different way. And I think that's why I'm really getting into my... Um, my single shadows because I can just take them apart and um you know put them back together when I when I don't want it anymore which sometimes happens in a week matter of fact speaking of color pop they already got something else out so nobody had people don't have raw beauty christy yet some people are still waiting on their child palette and guess what the holiday palette came out and one of the holiday palettes looks like one of their old palettes them and Huda you just duping yourself and people are still buying it. Yeah. Yadi, I'll see you later. Thank you for coming. Dr. Ash. Oh, the yeah, the Wayne Goss palettes are pants are pretty big. He said that he did that so that um why did he do that? I guess he said that so no matter what brush you use, it wouldn't mess up the pans or the brush or whatever the case may be. So all right, let's try this lipstick out. I'm really um, excited about it with the glitter. And I think this was 29. I know that's still high, but it's better than 56 or whatever it was. Mm -hmm. So this looks like, it looks like kind of beige, but I, it's more like pinky. I'm just going to use this e.l.f. ColourPop, those... um. I know Dr. Ash got them. Those, the dark blooms, I heard those were really, really nice. ColourPop be dropping palette. I'm telling you, I was so mad with Wild Nothing because they had dropped that palette. And then by the time I got it, they had dropped a whole nother collection that I liked better. They had like, it was just more, the colors were deeper and just richer. So I don't know. Hey, Aileen. I'm waiting for the chop. Yeah, the chop. I'm gonna tell you what ColourPop does have. They have the um, okay. I can't see this, but so that they have the um, cream gel liners that are really nice, and they used to have the colored mascara. That's where I got my colored mascara from. But I feel like it's been sold out for a really, really long time. So okay, let's try this lipstick. I don't know what that liner just did. It did a bunch of nothing. So if y'all didn't see it, this is like one of the, these glittery ones. Let's see something real quick. I have such a love-hate. I have a love-hate relationship with ColourPop. I'm always like, we're always breaking up and getting back together. But we don't get, if we do get back together, it won't be for long. It'll be like for one day. So this is like, okay. I was wondering with these glitter bombs, like does the glitter go all the way through? But I think the glitter, you know what this is reminding me of y'all? That overspray B on that Chantecaille blush. Find that blush real quick so I can get mad. I want to get mad all over again, hold on. Give me a second. This is pretty though, but it doesn't look like the color that I showed y'all, does it? Look. 
I was thinking this was going to be, uh, I don't know, brown. So this is more like a little, I like it though. Hold on, let me show y'all what I got mad about. It's right here. Because hmm. I didn't know what a, um, you know, I'm just new to this. So I didn't know what a overspray was. You know, I didn't know about that. This is my Chantecai, um Emotion blush. And so it came with the bumblebee on it. And the bumblebee was gold. And the reason that I bought this blush was because I thought the, the gold bumblebee went all the way through. And that it would give like a nice little, you know, a little, I don't know. But it damn sure didn't do that. That bee came off and that was all she wrote. It doesn't look the same color, Kendra. I agree. But it feels good. It's not, I got the um, the Dior lipstick and I was listening to um, Al Feisty talk about her, like her favorites and fails. I feel like that Dior matte was, well, this isn't a matte, but I feel like that Dior glitter one was a bit dry. So I really like this. I like it. That's the look, y'all. I'm excited for y'all. I mean, I'm excited for me, for all of us that y'all are here. Not that I'm not excited for y'all. I'm excited to be here with, <laughs> with y'all. Cause um I know this is kind of like an odd time. And I know my don't laugh about that B. And somebody and like everybody I said it to because I was mad, they were like, Oh yeah, it's an overspray. And I was like, Like, I know I got it on sale, but still. That's what I was thinking. I was thinking, Britt, that this was like a pumpkin color. Like a yeah. But lo and behold, I don't, I don't know why. Why does it look like that? The, look, like inside looks like the color on my lips. This is why it was on sale then, probably. Because people were like, it's deceiving. Maybe, I don't know. See my, the inside looks like the color on my lips but the outside does look like I thought this is why I got it because it was a pumpkin color and then they had um one that was like a really deep purple but now I'm thinking it probably wasn't um deep on the inside so thanks Janelle I don't know this makeup you know I think for me this is the last thing that I thought I would fall into like before I started buying makeup like a YouTuber I did collect like some you know like I was talking to Dr. Ashen last night no Rupee we were talking about what's our first palette I used to collect like some of the MAC singles like that but I never had any palettes I think my very I think my first palette was Born to Run the Urban Decay Born to Run oh yeah I'm gonna swatch the purple blood um yeah I think that was my first palette and I love that palette I love that palette yeah that lipstick is definitely fraudulent I gotta do a look with Agatha Orange though I gotta take that out of my box okay so this is the daydream quad and I'm gonna um swatch it I'll start with these two and then these two so let's see because for $45 for time for 88 but they said that out of all of the, Morgan Turner said this actually, out of all of the lipsticks, I mean, eyeshadow brands, I think, correct me if I'm wrong, Charlotte Tilbury is the most expensive. Like you you get more for the Tom Quad, uh, Tom Ford, like you get more uh, product versus the price because, I don't know, she did the math, y'all. She's on here, I don't know. But she said that. So there's the first purple. That's pretty. Yeah. So. Oh, this is nice. Ooh, I'm going to have to use this in. All right. And then I'm going to do this one and then this one. So this is the deep one. Yeah. Charlotte, Til Charlotte Tilbury has the worst value by far. Yep. Got me paying attention. So that's the deep shade and then you have this like lavender sh uh, shimmer so let me ask y'all a question the tom ford quads don't have a p 
period after opening symbol. I cannot find it anywhere, which means they do last forever in my mind. Like they're, they, I've looked on the boxes and everything and there's no, um, like it doesn't say how many months it lasts, which means it can last forever. Yeah, I, I like this a lot. This is so pretty. I'm going to have to do something with that. I also have, I have new dip. I have. This Frostfire one, let's watch this one. I don't think I've watched this one yet. I did see Mel Thompson do a look with this one though. This one's really, really pretty. The purple navy, yeah. You, let me tell y'all what I want. If, and I don't, I, I mean, it's not out and, all right, so this is like a shimmer topper. This is the shape right here. So this doesn't have much, uh, what would I call it? backbone i want the shade and illuminate tom ford palette in red harness that's what i want okay i don't even know what's going on here that red harness mm, like all of the other ones i know like i look because al feisty has them all and like i do like the rose cashmere i like the uh purple one and I like the blue one, but that red one, that's like right up my alley with those bronzy shades. Now, this is a pretty color. That's gorgeous. That's really pretty. This just reminds me of Frost. I guess that's why. What's the name? Yeah, these are pretty too. This color's not going to do too much for, you know, for everybody. But maybe you could put this on and then this on top or something like that. And then maybe it'll be a little bit better. Yeah, I have to, I have, um, oh, I'll, you'll have to look up the batch code to see how far it is from being expired. Yeah. Hey, Monique. Oh, hey, Strawberry One. Yes, Red Harness. Oh, my gosh. And then I started, I know, when they need to bring back Red Harness. That would be amazing if he did that. But my, my, they're $155. So you get a new life with that. Daydream. Ooh, that's pretty. The um, Floor Fantasia and the Daydream together. Ooh. Let me find out um, Melt's holiday collection was like the one that I'm really looking forward to. I love Pat, though. I love Pat. I know people were um, disappointed. Can I swatch one on your... Oh, yeah. Let me get a... Um, let me get a white real quick. Which one? The one. The purple? Hold on, I'm gonna wipe this off. Let me get a um. Let me get the white. I love this, guys. This is fun. Right, let's see. I got these wipes from uh. Oh, and Yachty got me to get the sh some Shiseido cotton. I'm like, what difference is this cotton with, uh, yeah, only $150, $155 for the red harness. Yachty got me to get some Shiseido cotton. I was like, is it better than regular cotton? <laughs> hey, Liz. Yeah, you get a new life for $155 with your red harness shades. You get the blush. You get the um, bronzer. And you get the new one. $155. All right, let's see. Okay. There's my little. I've been using this um this color pop. Color pop. For like eyeshadow primer. Okay, well, what do you do with the Shiseido cotton? Is it you what what is it for? To take your makeup off? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, you cut them in half. So you put your micellar water on or whatever. All right, Britt, which one? Yeah, Yachty. It's her fault. Is it you want to do the purple? Or are we doing the icy? We could do both. I don't know which one she said. These are also pretty though. 
I like the shiseido cut and I cut them too. Oh, shit. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. I thought she wanted me to swatch. <laughs> oh, well, that's okay. It's not like I need it for a thumbnail. Let me um pull it back out. I wasn't even going to get this. And then I went and looked up old videos and I was like, oh, this is so pretty. So, wait a minute. so we have the gold. This is the um, the duochrome. But look at that, y'all. I'm not saying it's like indie duochrome, but it's really pretty. Oh, she said purple. All right, let's look at these shades. Let's do, I want to do this one, this purple. Let's see. Oh, you were asking to swatch the, well, let me finish. And then we have the brown. I'm sorry, y'all, I'm sorry. <laughs> the Shiseido cotton wasn't, oh, uh, Clo Clo de po I don't know how much theirs is. The Shiseido wasn't crazy, but I guess I'm thinking that if you cut it in half, here it is. I'm thinking that if you cut it in half, like, I'm thinking it'll last a long time. Like, that's what I'm thinking. Oh, look at this, y'all. This is pretty. The, this is called Photosynthesex. Oh, I like this. I have never been a purple eyeshadow person, but when I did the Juvia's Place, um, the Nubian Royal one, so the the blue, this one with the teal is Photosynthesex, and then the one with the purple, this one, this one is Daydream. Are these quads on sale? Yes, that's where I got, I got all the stuff from Sex. Yep, um, and I got Double Indemnity too, but I got that one um, a couple of months ago. So, let's just do a whole new look on this side. This is when I go back to work and my kids will be like, Miss oh, Chambers, what are you doing? It's okay, I'm watching YouTube videos while I teach virtually at the local jail. Lord. <laughs> you know, I feel like I spend most, most of my life multitasking and that's part of it, it's good to do that that i can do that but then sometimes i feel like i'm never focused on anything did i miss something hold on Photos. yeah sorry photosynthesex is the green one with the teal and that one's on sale for i think 40. And I like it. Like, I don't, do y'all care about like if something's like discontinued or anything like that? Or is it like whatever? Cause that's how I feel. I feel like whatever. I still want the um, Tom Ford Dive mom. <laughs> like I still want that one. But I know First Frost is really similar, but I think um, the other one is a little bit warmer. And I still kind of want that one. So, I don't know. For some reason, let me see what's going on here. Oh, there we go. I was missing some comments. Multi yeah, multitasking. This one's really pretty, y'all. I can see why Morgan really likes this. Like, this is really pretty. And this gives me a chance to really try stuff out. Like, yeah, Saks off fifth. Hey, Dahlia. It's like the little outlet store. And they have like, I mean, it's not just this. I mean, they have clothes. They have everything like that. But I haven't been buying any clothes. So I'm going to just go ahead and be on this makeup thing. Daydream went, Molly, Daydream, it, you got to keep checking because it went off and then it came back. This is the second time. Oh, yeah, no worries. I understand. I, I usually have a 15-minute lunch break, Dahlia, so I appreciate you stopping it. 
Liz, you're going to get Divine Rose too. That's the palette of the year as far as I'm concerned. Yes, on sale. Too rich for my blood. $40. That's, that's not that bad. I mean, from 88. Yeah. I haven't been to like um, TJ Maxx or anything like that in a long time, but I heard that like they end up having like so much stuff there now, like so much stuff. And the other thing is that, um, oh, shoes. So I've been finding shoes in my closet like that I must have bought before quarantine, like sneakers and stuff. So I'm, I'm really trying to, um, I'm really trying to use that because I, I'm not going anywhere. Like I have a lot of shoes right now. Some I have on some Nikes. I'm like, I can't tell you the last time I've worn them, but like, mm -hmm. I like it. Put the mascara back on. And then I'll have one purple eye and one um, blue eye. I still want to say something. And then, you know, Black Friday. And then there's already spring stuff. Divine Rose 2, though, Liz, is really, like, one of the best palettes. Like, it, it is, I just feel like there was a lot of anticipation for it. And um, I I like it way better than Divine Rose 1. I feel like you can just do so much more. Divine Rose 1 is nice, but it's really toned down. But you can still, bye, K Bella, thank you. You can still do a lot with it and then, you know, tone it down. <laughs> I'm a TJ Maxx and he's saying a Marshall's Maven. So I have not really been going to stores. That's the thing. And I do need to go to Walgreens today, but it's like, it'll be like, I have to go there. Like, it's not like, oh, I just like, I have not been to Target. You know, I love Target. Now they're going to bring Ulta in Target. I don't need to go to Target. Did y and then they have the hourglass now at Target. And they have some palettes that I don't know where they um I don't know where because they don't sell them in Sephora, so there's some different palettes from hourglass at Ulta that I haven't seen before. But oh I need a remote. So there's some fallout on my face from the first um look, but that's the purple which I probably could blend out a little bit better. And then the blue. So I like them both. Yes. Oh, no, I didn't make you. No. I have my graph and Natasha did no, no. So I did get that glam palette. I have to, like I said, I have to roast myself about that one because that was me, like, not giving into the FOMO. And I definitely gave in to that. And I did not need it. Did not need it. Let's see. Bye, Kendra. Thank you. All right. Well, y'all, this is my little lunch bunch. I'm so excited. I'm going to have to get used to this, but I'm, I'm really excited. My camera didn't overheat. It's just... This is good. My stomach's not rumbling anymore. <laughs> I was really, really nervous. I like the purple too, Auntie Merle. I really like it a lot. I'm going to have to. Yeah, I'm going to have to. I like it. Saks all fit. It's still on sale for $44. I still have to get used to using um, Ebates. I'm so bad with that. But yeah, I do like this. I like it a lot. Um, so just let me know. Like, y'all feel like the lighting is okay, but it's more so the sound. So I'm trying to think what I should use for the sound. Because I want to try to do this. If I could do this like once a week, this would be great. Like I don't want to take a lot of y'all time. You know what I'm saying? Just a little lunch break type thing. And, you know, so Britt, you got to let me know. I'll um, Marco Polo you about the, um, the graphics card, I guess. I just want to see how I can make this, um, you know, I want to get my sound right. So that's it, y'all. Yeah. Wait, Janelle, how far behind are you? How many hours? Yeah, I have to I have to get this sound together. Yeah, this is a huge crowd for midday. I really do appreciate y'all. 
perfect. So I had the external mic in, but then there was a really bad echo. Y'all should see this microphone. It's got the boom arm. It's hanging down like I'm in a studio. It's just a lot going on. So the background static is my fan. Okay, let me see. I'm going to try the other mic again really quick, y'all, before we hang up. And then I'm going to... Oh, I got to... Oh, here's the cord. Okay, I'm just going to plug it in really fast. Now, is it echoing again? Because I have the echo cancellation on. Nine hundred. Oh my God, Kelly! I'll try. I'm I'm trying to help with this. So it's echoing. All right, I'm going back to the built-in mic. All right, y'all. Well, hopefully it went away. And um, I will work on the sound before I, um, you know, try to do this again. I'm going to try to, like I said, I'm going to try to do this just once a week. And then, um, you know, I'll work on it. But I was really trying to test it out and, uh, you know, just, just see. All right. Oh, now I'm far away. Oh, All right, y'all. Let me turn it off. What about now? It's like two mics on one. Yeah. Well, let me let y'all go. I don't want to hold y'all. We need a live with your camera set up. You, this setup in here, I was telling my sister, like, it looks like a, a hazard at this point. But I do have uh, surge protectors. So, all right, y'all. I I have a video coming up tomorrow, but um, I'll talk to y'all. Do I just hang up now? I hope y'all have a really great rest of the day. This really made my day, y'all. Hmm. I'm just going to sit here until y'all hang up. I need a volume. Let me see something. Can I turn the volume? The volume's up to 100, though. All right. Thank you, Monique. Thank you, guys. I'm going to hang up and try to figure out what's going on. The other sound was... This is the other sound. This is the other sound. This is the built-in mic. So I'll work on that, y'all. Have a great rest of the day, and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye. Bye when I figure out how to hang up. Okay, now I'm hanging up. Bye. Oh, what, is, what do I usually say? Make sure you're being gentle with yourself. Talk to yourself nice. Stay safe. And I'll see y'all in the next one.